Ever wondered what the future of armored fighting doctrine looks like? Brace yourself for a journey through time. We're at a critical juncture in military history where the evolution of armored warfare is taking a dramatic turn. The focus of our discussion today is the Future Combat Systems Program, an ambitious initiative that aimed to revolutionize the way we fight on the battlefield. Despite its eventual dismissal, the program's conceptual ideas are making a comeback, promising a radical shift in armored fighting doctrine. One such resurrection is the General Dynamics Abrams X prototype, a marvel of modern military technology, equipped with the innovative XM360 lightweight 120mm cannon. This cannon, designed at Bennett Labs in upstate New York, weighs in at nearly half that of its predecessor, the M256. This is just a glimpse of the transformative power of the Future Combat Systems program. Now let's rewind the clock and start from the inception of the Future Combat Systems program. The Future Combat Systems program started with high hopes. The year was 2005, and the dream? To revolutionize the way we think about armored combat. The program sought to integrate new technologies and concepts to enhance the combat capabilities of the U.S. Army, making it faster, stronger, and smarter than ever before. Central to this vision was the development of a new breed of weaponry, and at the heart of this new breed was the XM-360 lightweight 120mm cannon. It was designed to be a game-changer. Weighing in at only 4,100 pounds, nearly half the weight of the old M-256 cannon, the XM-360 promised to bring agility and speed to the battlefield without sacrificing firepower. But as we know, the best laid plans often go awry. The Future Combat Systems program faced numerous challenges from cost overruns to technological hurdles. The ambitious goals of the program seemed more like distant dreams. And in the end, the XM360 was one of the many promising ideas that were scrapped when the program was disbanded. Yet, as the saying goes, what is past is prologue. Many of the seemingly failed ideas from the Future Combat Systems program are now being resurrected. And why not? After all, good ideas never die they just wait for the right time to come to life. And so, the XM360 found a new home. The mines at Bennett Labs, the U.S. Army's primary design, development, engineering, and production facility for large-caliber armament systems, took the once-discarded concept and breathed new life into it. This cannon, which was once destined for the scrap heap, is now the star of the show. One such resurrected idea is the Abrams X prototype. It promises to change the armored fighting doctrine completely. With the XM360 as its centerpiece, the Abrams X is set to bring the dreams of the future combat systems program to life. It's a testament to the spirit of innovation and resilience, and it's a reminder that the future of combat is always evolving, always pushing boundaries and always looking for ways to be better, faster, and stronger. General Dynamics shook the military world in 2022 with the release of the Abrams X prototype. This wasn't just another tank rolling off the assembly line, it was an entirely new approach to armored warfare. The Abrams X prototype is a tangible testament to innovation and resilience. From the ashes of the future combat systems program, many of the once discarded ideas are now re-emerging, and the Abrams X is leading the charge. One of the most significant features of the Abrams X is its main gun, the XM360 lightweight 120mm cannon. This modern marvel of military engineering is a game-changer in terms of firepower and maneuverability. Weighing in at just over 4,000 pounds, it's nearly half the weight of the old M256 cannon. This results in a lighter, more agile tank that can deliver the same devastating firepower. The XM360 is not a new invention, though. It was originally designed for the Future Combat Systems program way back in 2005. Despite the program's eventual cancellation, the XM360 didn't end up on the scrap heap. Instead, it has found a new home on the Abrams X, proving that good ideas can endure. And let's not forget the role of Bennett Labs in the development of this cannon. Located in upstate New York's Watervliet Arsenal, Bennett Labs has been the U.S. Army's primary design, development, engineering, and production facility for large-caliber armament systems since 1887. The XM360 is the latest in a long line of innovations to come from this historic institution. The Abrams X prototype is more than just a new tank, it's a demonstration of how the US Army is rethinking armored warfare. By leveraging innovative technology and learning from past experiences, they're building a future where tanks are lighter, more agile and more powerful than ever before. 
The Abrams X prototype is not just a tank, it's a glimpse into the future of armored warfare. The Abrams X prototype isn't just a new piece of hardware, it's a game changer. This is not an overstatement. The Abrams X, with its XM360 lightweight cannon, represents a turning point in armored fighting doctrine. By reducing the weight of the tank's main armament by nearly half, the Abrams X has the potential to revolutionize how tanks are deployed and utilized on the battlefield. Imagine a tank that can move faster, maneuver more easily, and deliver devastating firepower, all while being more fuel efficient. That's the promise of the Abrams X. And it's not just about speed and maneuverability. The weight reduction could also open up possibilities for air deployment of tanks, something that has traditionally been challenging due to the sheer weight of these armored beasts. But the implications go beyond just the battlefield. The Abrams X could redefine the very concept of armored warfare. With lighter tanks, armies could potentially field more of them, changing the dynamics of force projection. This could put pressure on other nations to develop similar lightweight tanks, triggering a new arms race in armored warfare. The implications of the Abrams X aren't limited to the military world. The technology developed for this tank could have civilian applications as well. The weight-saving technologies could be used in commercial vehicles, increasing fuel efficiency, and reducing emissions. The advanced materials developed could find their way into everything from construction equipment to passenger vehicles. The Abrams X, therefore, represents a major leap forward in both military and civilian technology. It's a testament to the ingenuity of the engineers at General Dynamics and Bennett Labs, who have taken ideas from a scrapped program and turned them into a viable, game-changing prototype. The Abrams X is more than just a new tank, it's a symbol of the future, a future where armored warfare is faster, more dynamic and more efficient, a future where the lessons learned on the battlefield can help drive innovation in the civilian world. The Abrams X prototype is set to redefine armored warfare. It's a testament to human ingenuity and a symbol of the future of armored fighting doctrine.